Leave me alone. Doggy, what did you do? The fireworks were awesome. Except for the one that went into my eye. <laughs> what happened to you? I fell asleep at the kitchen table. What? I just did. I had some drinks when I got home. What about that guy? That guy? That guy that you live with? He's sleeping. He was sleeping when I got home. His name is Brad. His name is Assface. Why'd you do this? Why do you have mud all over your legs? Why'd you do this? I asked you first. You did not. Stop acting like a child. You're such a spaz. You shouldn't be left alone with experiences. I didn't want to be alone. It's all my fault now. The night before, I have to bury my father. What are you even doing here? Kristen McConnell called me. Kristen? From high school? She's a nurse here. She said you came in and you kept saying my name, so she called me. They thought you tried to kill yourself. <laughs> Who tries to kill themselves with fireworks? I know. <laughs> I told them, no, you're just a crackhead dumbass with shit for brains. Now, I told them <laughs> you would never commit suicide because you wouldn't have any scars to show off afterward. Anyway, she said you got hurt. Why'd you come? I don't know, Dougie. I was asleep on the kitchen table and Kristen calls me from the freaking hospital. Look at you. Tooth and now your eye. Why do you have mud all over your legs? I drove part of the way until the car got stuck in the mud. What do you mean? What? I mean, I drove part of the way until the car got stuck in the mud. The car got stuck in the mud? Yeah. What? What are you talking about? What? 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 What mud? Where is there this mud between your house and the hospital that like you could get stuck just in? Just don't. What? Just shut up. There's mud. On the side of the road. You veered off the road? Are you drunk? No. <laughs> I'm just, the windshield is all jacked up because Brad hit a tree last February and I couldn't see. I mean, there was this mist or fog or something. And I drank a few vodkas, but I mostly slept those off. So you just left the car. You know how I get? How you get? Fuck you, you know how I get. You get hurt. You know. Doctor said I'm going to be blind in one eye. Ducky. It's gone. The whole thing. But uh, it wasn't just, you know, the poke. It was the burn, too. You know, the thing kept burning once it had punctured the eye, and so the burn really messed it all up. You always had problems with that eye. <laughs> yeah. The chopping wedge? And that girl who skated on your eye, right? Uh. When you were little. <laughs> and then senior year, the Tabasco sauce. And pink eye. Yeah. I gave you pink eye that time. No, you didn't. I never got it. I think about that all the time. I think about that all the time. I always think about it. Yeah, well, you're a freak. I'm fat. I didn't want you to come in here. Yeah, right. No, I'm, I mean, I'm glad you're here, for sure. But you have the funeral tomorrow and everything, you know. You should go home. Take a bath and get some rest. Shut up. I don't feel like walking back to my car just yet. Wow, you're really drunk, aren't you? No, I'm just bleary. I feel like I just woke up. You don't understand the week I've had. Now, I had to get a call at work telling me my dad is lying dead in the driveway and then dealing with everyone and this shit. And then tonight, you come riding into town. Here comes Dougie all of a sudden, five years later. I haven't slept. I just haven't slept in, I don't know, like four years or something. How many fingers am I holding up? Four. How about now? Shut up. <laughs> we can both hardly see. Maybe that's for the best.
What's going to happen to us? Nothing. Seriously? I don't know. What? I don't know. I think I'm seeing two of you. <laughs> I'm seeing two of you too. Let's dance. Shut up. <laughs> no, we can dance. All four of us. We can play a ring around the roses. Sit down. <laughs> I'm seriously dizzy. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> oh, Lini, a Lini Dini, my Lini Dini, Manny Mo Mo Weeny, my Lini Dini, Danny Do, Danny Do, Danny Do. Will you touch it? What? My eye. You don't have an eye. My eye socket. That's disgusting. I probably can't smoke in here, right? Well, will you touch it? What are you talking about? Stop being weird. You've always been able to mend my wounds. Great. Glad I could have been of service. I'm just gonna go smoke. What are they gonna do? I know it's probably like superstition, but I kind of need it. <laughs> you know you always do it. I don't always do anything. You've got like superpowers. Even tonight, when we kissed, you kissed my missing tooth. The gap, and it stopped hurting. Well, I'm not touching your disgusting eye socket. What are you doing? You'll do it. You'll touch it. You'll heal me. The pills only last so long. Stop that. Once the pills wear off, it's going to kill again. You've got to just touch it. Doug, stop doing that. It's okay. I know what I'm doing, okay? I really don't want to see this. I just need you to help me out, Lini. You know. You know what you do. Will you please just touch my eye? Get away from me. Doug, I can't look at that. Please, put your, put that stuff back over it. This can't be healthy, come on. You can make it better. No, no, I can't. Leave me alone. Just touch it once. No, I will not. I'm not here to take care of you, Doug. I'm not a healer. I'm in pain. Do you understand that? I don't care. Then leave! Get out of here! Fucking go!